Darkness. It's a moonless night in the city that never sleeps. The usual hustle and bustle is replaced by an eerie silence. Suddenly, a chilling scream pierces the still air. The screen fades to black, leaving only the echo of that scream lingering in our ears. A single line of text appears. The tragic tale of Sadiq Ridoy begins here. A moment of silence, then the screen brightens, revealing the title of our story. The mysterious death of Sadiq. As viewers, we are left wondering, who was Sadiq? Why did his life end so abruptly? Stay with us as we unravel the answers to these questions in this episode of Beyond the Verdict. Welcome to Beyond the Verdict, where we delve into the mysteries of true crime. Our channel peels back the layers of the most gripping cases, revealing the human stories beneath the headlines. Today, we bring you a tragic tale that strikes at the heart of our shared humanity. A young man named Sadiq, full of dreams and potential, whose life was abruptly ended by those he called friends. Stay tuned as we unravel the mysterious and heart-wrenching story of Sadiq. Born in the bustling city of Chattogram, Bangladesh, Sadiq's story starts in a humble household. Shibli Sadiq Ridoy, or simply Sadiq, was the only child of a truck driver, Maryland Shafiq, and a housewife, Nahid Akhtar. Theirs was a family that knew the meaning of hard work and the value of every tucker. Sadiq's dreams were as big as the city he was born in. He thirsted for knowledge and was passionate about his studies. But life had dealt him a challenging hand. His father's earnings as a truck driver barely covered the family's basic needs. The prospect of college, with its promise of a better future, seemed like an unreachable star in the sky. But Sadiq was not one to surrender to his circumstances. He found a job at a local poultry farm, a place filled with clucking hens and the smell of hay. The work was hard, the hours long, but Sadiq held on to his dreams tightly. Every coin he earned brought him one step closer to his goal of a college education. The poultry farm was more than just a workplace for Sadiq. It was his second home, a place where he grew from a boy to a man. His dedication and hard work did not go unnoticed. The farm owner saw the spark in him and promoted him from a worker to a manager. This was an accomplishment that Sadiq wore with humility, not pride. The farm was also a place where Sadiq made friends. They were older than him by half a decade, but they respected him. They saw his commitment, his seriousness, and they admired him for it. Despite the odds, Sadiq was determined to make a better life for himself and his family. He was a beacon of hope in a world that often seemed dark. Little did he know what fate had in store for him. Sadiq quickly made a name for himself at the poultry farm. His dedication and hard work did not go unnoticed. His days started early and ended late, with hardly a moment to spare. His hands, though young, were capable and steady dealing with the demands of the job with ease and efficiency. Sadiq's diligence was rewarded as he climbed the ranks, moving from a humble worker to a manager. This was no easy feat. It was a testament to his tenacity and commitment to his job. Yet this promotion did not change him. He remained the same humble, hard-working young man, leading by example and showing his peers that age was no barrier to success. His co-workers, Men who were older and more experienced found themselves working under the leadership of this young man. Yet, there was no resentment. Instead, they respected Sadiq. They saw in him not just a manager, but a friend, a confidant, a leader who was willing to get his hands dirty, to work shoulder to shoulder with them. Sadiq was not just their boss. He was one of them. In spite of the grueling work, Sadiq never complained. He had a goal, a dream. He wanted to pay his college fees to give himself a chance at a better life. So he saved every penny he could, putting aside a portion of his earnings for his education. The poultry farm was not just his workplace, it was his stepping stone towards a brighter future. Sadiq's relationships with his co-workers were characterized by mutual respect and camaraderie. He was not just their manager, he was their friend. He had a knack for bringing people together, for fostering a sense of community within the workplace. His influence went beyond his job description. 
He was a source of inspiration, a beacon of hope, a symbol of hard work and determination. In spite of his young age, Sadiq earned the respect of his peers at the farm. His story is a testament to the power of hard work, dedication, and the unwavering belief in one's dreams. But Sadiq's life took a tragic turn one fateful night. The sun had set on a day that started just like any other. In the deepening twilight of Chattogram, Sadiq was wrapping up his duties at the poultry farm, blissfully unaware of the horror that lay ahead. His friends, the ones he had laughed with, worked alongside and trusted, were about to play a chilling role in his life. The night was steeped in a deceptive calm, the silence punctuated by the occasional clucking of the chickens. Sadiq's friends, older and seemingly wiser, invited him to join them for a casual get-together, an invitation that Sadiq accepted without a second thought. After all, they were his friends, his confidants, his allies in this hard-knock life. As the evening wore on, the atmosphere turned ominous. The friendly banter and the camaraderie of the past were replaced by a tension that was almost palpable. Sadiq, naive and trusting, was oblivious to the sinister undercurrents. His friends, the same people who had once worked under his guidance, were now plotting a course of action that would shatter his world. As the clock ticked closer to midnight, Sadiq's fate was being sealed in the darkness. His friends, driven by motives that remain a mystery to this day, were about to commit an act so heinous it would send shockwaves through the community. The poultry farm, a place of livelihood and dreams for Sadiq, was about to turn into a horrifying crime scene. The night that started with laughter and camaraderie ended in a chilling silence. The unsuspecting Sadiq, who had dared to dream and work hard for those dreams, was caught in a web of deceit and treachery spun by his own friends. The fateful night, cloaked in darkness and betrayal, was the beginning of a tragic end for Sadiq. And thus, the ordinary day folded into an extraordinary night, a night that would forever be etched in the annals of Chattogram's history, a night that would leave a young dreamer's life hanging by a thread. What started as a normal day ended in a nightmare for Sadiq. The aftermath of the crime brought forth a whirlwind of investigations. The local police were quick to respond, arriving at the poultry farm in the early morning hours. Sadiq's lifeless body, a grim reminder of the tragedy that had transpired, was carefully examined for any signs of foul play. The clues at the crime scene were puzzling. Sadiq's personal belongings were untouched. His wallet, still filled with the money he had saved for his college fees, was found intact. This immediately ruled out robbery as a motive. The investigators turned their attention to Sadiq's relationships, particularly those with his friends at the farm. Sadiq was well-liked, respected by his colleagues, but was there more than meets the eye? The investigators began to dig deeper, questioning each of Sadiq's friends. Initial interrogations yielded little information, but as the pressure built, cracks began to show. It was the shocking revelations that followed which painted a picture far removed from the respect and camaraderie Sadiq had seemingly enjoyed. It turned out that beneath the surface, resentment had been brewing. The promotions Sadiq had earned, his meteoric rise from a regular worker to a manager, had not sat well with some. His friends, older and with more years at the farm, began to view his success as an affront. They were not content with working under someone significantly younger, and this discontent had, it seemed, taken a dark turn. One by one, their stories began to align. A plot to teach Sadiq a lesson had been hatched, fueled by jealousy and bruised egos. What was intended as a scare tactic, however, had gone horribly wrong resulting in the tragic end of a young man's life. The evidence was damning. The confessions, the testimonies of other workers, and the forensic findings all pointed towards Sadiq's friends. The very people he had worked with, respected, and considered friends were now prime suspects in his untimely demise. The investigation was a stark reminder of how quickly dreams can turn into nightmares, friendships into betrayals. The police were swift in their action, 
arresting those involved, and ensuring they faced the full force of the law. Justice was about to be served, but at the cost of a young man's life. The investigation had revealed the ugly truth, the dark side of human nature, and the devastating consequences of jealousy and resentment. Sadiq's story serves as a cautionary tale, a tragic reminder of the devastating outcomes when envy overshadows respect and camaraderie. Sadiq's story serves as a chilling reminder of the unpredictability of life. A young man full of dreams and aspirations, his life was tragically cut short, not by a stranger, but by those he considered friends. His story is a stark reminder of the depths of human deceit and a testament to the frailty of trust. The ripples of this tragedy extend far beyond Sadiq himself. His family, bereft of their only child, a community shocked by the brutality of the crime and a society forced to confront the harsh realities of trust betrayed. This incident has left an indelible mark, a scar that will take time to heal. Yet in the midst of this darkness, there is a glimmer of hope. Sadiq's dedication to his studies, his commitment to supporting his family, his tireless work ethic, these are the attributes that will be remembered. Even in his absence, Sadiq's story continues to resonate, reminding us of the preciousness of life. Thank you for joining us on this journey as we unraveled the heartbreaking story of Sadiq. His life and untimely demise serve as a poignant reminder of the unpredictability of life, the volatility of trust, and the enduring strength of human spirit. If this story resonated with you, we urge you to like and share this video. It's through sharing such narratives that we can collectively bring about awareness and perhaps change. If you're new here or have not done so already, please subscribe to our channel, Beyond the Verdict. We bring to you compelling stories from around the globe, stories that need to be heard, stories that stir the soul. Stay tuned for more. Remember, every story matters and yours could be the next.